the United States and China continue to have the most important bilateral relationship in the world. But over the course of my career, I've never seen this relationship more fraught. This goes too far. It will create what I've called an economic iron curtain, one that decouples supply chains and erects incompatible rules and standards throughout the global economy, impeding innovation and economic growth. I recommend an approach of targeted reciprocity, a focus on reciprocal rules, market access, and actions, not on a mechanical or reflexive basis, but in a way that makes sense for our two countries, firms, and workers. So let's compete, let's coordinate, and yes, let's cooperate when it's in our self-interest to do so. One of the key areas of potential cooperation between our countries is climate. It is important that we promote the free flow of environmental goods and services by removing barriers such as tariffs. Explore joint developments of clean technology and develop means of pricing natural resources. The world will benefit from cooperation between the officials and businesses of both countries on climate change. 